This lesson will show how to find the cofactor of a two by two matrix. Cofactors are used in cofactor expansion or expansion by minors to find the determinant of a square matrix. The cofactor of a sub i comma j is equal to negative one raised to the power of i plus j times the minor of a sub i comma j. The minor of a sub i comma j is equal to the determinant of the matrix formed by eliminating row i and column j from matrix A. To begin, we're asked to find the cofactor of A sub two comma one. We begin by determining the element in row two column one, which is the one. To find the minor, we will need to eliminate row two and column one from the given matrix A. So the cofactor of a sub two comma one is equal to negative one raised to the power of two plus one times the determinant of the matrix formed by eliminating row two and column one from matrix A. We need to find the determinant of the one by one matrix where the element is seven, which we indicate using vertical bars. We don't want to confuse these vertical bars with absolute value. If we take a look at our notes below, if we have a one by one matrix, the determinant of the matrix is equal to the element itself. So simplifying, we have negative one raised to the third power times the determinant of the one by one matrix where the element is seven, which is equal to seven. This gives us negative one times seven, which equals negative seven. The cofactor of a sub two comma one is negative seven. For the second example, we're asked to find the cofactor of b sub two comma two. We assume the given matrix is matrix B. So we begin by identifying the element in row two column two, which is the three. To find the minor, we will have to eliminate row two and column two. Notice once again, this leaves us with a one by one matrix with an element of negative one. So the cofactor of B sub two comma two is equal to negative one raised to the power of two plus two times the minor of B sub two comma two, which is equal to the determinant of the one by one matrix with an element of negative one. Simplifying, we have negative one to the fourth, which is positive one times the determinant of the one by one matrix where the element is negative one, which is the element itself of negative one. And one times negative one, of course, is negative one. So again, don't confuse the notation of vertical bars with absolute value here. It does represent the determinant of, in this case, a one by one matrix. I hope you found this helpful.